would make a movie for me and brush my teeth in the morning. <laughs> uh, I build a clean, cleaning robot. I build a cooking robot. I build a partner robot. I love robots. Um, I'll find stuff that you lose. I would make it protect me, and I would make it transform into things. It would build me a car and do my homework for me. And I got to make it have wheels and legs. I will put a laser right here. So you have an app on your phone for it, and then you push a button if you lost it, and then it'll make a ringing sound, and then you'll know where it is. Turn it into a little um, a suit for me that it'll make me breathe underwater. They do not breathe like us because they're, they're all built in with a memory chip. Our memory chip is a brain, and it needs air, oxygen, liquids to keep us alive. It would go to California. What would it do in California? Cartwheels. Well, it could take you anywhere. It could take you to the park. It could take you to the plane. Go beat up a shark. <laughs> he is in the Amazonian jungle of the future. -na 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 -na. So I got to do ears and a hat. How many years in the future do you think before we'll see robots like that? I say tops 50, minimum, minimum 20. No. No, I, I, I just use my imagination. I wish, but no. <laughs> How cool is it that the things that we make help make themselves? Okay, so last week we had you guys in the office and we told you that we wanted your help uh, designing your line of robots. Yeah. And you guys came up with some amazing ideas. So we just wanted to give you a special token of our gratitude. So this is our thank you for no, making thank robots you. with us. So awesome. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. Can I use a potato head? Please. I should put extra on here. I'll get a picture of you. There we go. Thank you. Yay. Yeah,